Okay, let's give this a try. Um, basically, trying to install some of my older PC games on my phone using WinLater, which is essentially why not Proton for Android phones. And yeah, here are some of the specs. It's not much. Um, Yeah, I have a Galaxy S20. Not the FE, the regular one. And... Yeah, when... Uh, at, mo at the moment of this recording... Version... Seven what is it? I don't know. Ten dot one it should be. Of when later is out. Yes. And you can grab it on GitHub. It's totally free and open source and what it allows you to do is, as mentioned before, Install Windows software on Android phones, provided the phone is strong enough to handle it. I'm just going to think around with it a bit. Already tried to run Gravity Circuit, which I have on uh, good old games. It works fine for me, using similar settings to what my rusty ThinkPad X50 has. And yeah. I grabbed some of my games from GOG, downloaded them, put them on uh, the phone, and tried to install these. Doing some slight modifications to the base settings. Also going for... Um, HD graphics, I have 20, because this is, as mentioned, it should be on the same page as the ThinkPad, not certain though about the um, VRAM size, I believe it's 1 gig, I keep it at that. No, no changes to the wind components or environment settings. And this is fine too. Um, yeah, okay. Create the container. Set up the container. Inside the container, let's run it first. That takes a while because it's preparing everything. It's really essentially wine. And here we are on the desktop, on the wine desktop. Let's install some games, shall we? Nice. Yes, I read the EULA, uh, nobody cares about it. Uh, 
I just uh, have to, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes. That took quite a while. Hopefully the other games aren't as painfully slow to install. But then again, um, Gravity Circuit insults. Not as fast as on a PC, of course, but still. That's that. Say so, yeah, I have to install Gothic, but not after installing Beyond Good and Evil for almost 30 minutes. Yeah, I'll try Age of Empires 2. That old demo version I've got from years ago. Let's give these games a shot. Not to certain which one I shall try first though. Every single game could crash potentially and I don't know how it behaves then. Let's go with Into the Breach first. Oh, sweet, it's lovely. Let's give it a shot. See how it runs. All of humanity destroyed, yes, I know. Mm -hmm. Holy smokes.
but now it's running fine. Hmm. Well, it's not perfectly 60 FPS, but it's fast enough for a turn-based game. And I don't have to pay the stupid um, Netflix subscription to play on my phone. That's quite nice. Nice, nice. Um, yeah, so much for that game. It definitely works, just not at full speed, as mentioned three times already. And I can even save and quit and stuff. Okay, let's um, try Age of Empires. That should work. It's so old, I don't expect any issues. Okay, let's um, give out run a try then. Yes, that's out run two thousand six. Oh, nothing. You move the other drivers. There it is. Works fine.
so I can indeed use my keyboards. Nice, nice. One more try with this. Oh my god, it works now. And it's low. And it doesn't react to my controls. Let's try this again with the controller. Maybe this time it works. Love how it does my settings. Yeah, the controller works though, that's nice. Let's see how long it takes to load. Not too bad. It's uh, 20 seconds, I believe. I can't accelerate though. That's a bummer. Wait, can I do it using the keyboard? Yes, that would. It's pressing on the brake for no reason. Okay, so much for that, but at least it works theoretically. So two games work and two games refuse to work. Three games even, if I come then the gravity circuit. Hmm. Oh well, I'm pretty certain newer phones are better, especially ones that use um, 
another SOC. It's still a fun experiment. Alright, I'm going to trim this video so it's not like about an hour long. And maybe it helps someone. And yeah. If you watched this, thank you for doing so. It was just some silly thing. Because I had nothing to do on a wet warm day evening. And yeah. See you around.